Welcome back everyone to a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys how to stop your PC or laptop or anything uh, that has like is on Windows running on our Windows OS stop crashing when you're exporting a video or doing something that requires extensive power so uh, the reason this is happening is because your processor is running at 100% power or your graphics card but I'll show you guys how to fix that so what you guys want to do is type your Windows key or whatever go to the search bar and then from here just type in power uh okay not powerpoint power plan just type in power space plan there we go okay there it is at the bottom power space plan not powerpoint i don't know why that showed up i'll be just click that then from here you want to go to change advanced power settings once you click this you're gonna get uh this tab that comes off just drag this to the side so it doesn't confuse you guys and then from here let's go to the bottom and then you want to click on processor power management it is the third from the bottom you just tap on the plus bar right next to it and then here it's going to say minimum processor state and maximum processor state this is where you're going to change these two values so the minimum processor state is pretty much showing you how the minimum that your processor can work so this is probably going to be at 100 percent which means that the minimum your processor 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 can be working at any specific time is 100 percent so this will make it overheat and uh, if it's working too much, it'll just have your PC crash or changes from anywhere to 90 to 95%. Then here, maximum processor state. If you have this at 100, that means the most it can work at is 100%, which can make your PC crash. So just move this to 95%. This can just make your game run at like 5 FPS less or make your rendering like take another minute. It's not going to affect your PC that much, but it will not make it crash this worked for me hopefully this works for you guys um it, this might be because of your graph graphics processor unit as well so you can change that i don't know where you change that but uh if you just look around you should be able to find it but yeah hope this helped you out and i'll see you guys on the next video oh yeah make sure you do apply it in the bottom right before you exit out if not it won't change